Thanks for the ride. Maybe I should come too? <sighs> Samuel, I'm 18 now. I get it. Since you met Danny... Just... <sighs> Go home. I'll be fine. <clears throat> Your brother again. <sighs> Come on, let's get a drink. Are you looking for someone? Could you help me find my sister? Naomi is her name. You seem worried for her. I'm worried that she didn't make it. Lately, she changed. She became a... Rebel? Come. Let me show you how it all started. Was I not right? Are we ever consulted about anything? No. We only need to obey. It doesn't matter what we want, what we feel, what we think. Is this the kingdom of love and freedom? That is what we are being told. We know not what happened to him. He was the best of us. The light bearer. And then, he thought he could be like God. Independent. Brothers, now we hear about this new creature to be made. That will have the ability to procreate. Not even we have this ability. Has anyone asked us if we agree to that? I long for a world where everyone is free to speak and to choose for himself. But first, we have to get rid of this tyrant and all of his rules. Follow me. I promise you freedom. Naomi. 
Naomi. <gasps> Naomi. Are you... Naomi? Uh... Naomi, what's wrong? Uh... <laughs> There's nothing wrong. Are you okay? Uh, I... She's free to live her own life. Uh... Leave her alone. <laughs> we have to go. Now. We were all eager to see this new thing, made from the dust of the earth. Then the master breathed life into it, and it became a living soul. the opportunity to campaign. She was so naive, such easy prey. Why? They were warned, and that tree became their voting booth. Why do you hesitate? Take a bite. The master said not to eat from it or we will die. Nonsense. Did I die? On the contrary. It made me speak. Me, an animal. Imagine what it could do to you. You would become like him. A 
divine being, independent and immortal. But he commanded us. <laughs> commanded? Maybe he suggested or recommended. You are free. No one can tell you what to do. Eve? What have you done? He commanded us. Commanded? We are free beings. Eat. We have the same destiny. If you really love me. It could have all ended here, had they resisted. Instead, it became the beginning of an endless struggle. your beloved human pair voted for me, the new ruler of planet Earth. It's just sad that you will have to kill my new subjects, as you promised. That is my decision. Very well. In the meantime, do not interfere in the internal business of a sovereign territory. We were all waiting for his decision, according to his own law. They were meant to die. Please, don't let this happen. They didn't die that day. I never understood why. We did not know why either. Master asked them to sacrifice animals. Somehow, this made it possible for them to continue living. What did Cain do wrong? He thought he could do it his own way. Like Eve, independent of his creator and against his rules. Uh, uh. 
Under Lucifer's leadership, things got bad. So bad that the master decided to leave only a remnant. The pressure is coming. Trouble is coming. When the earthquakes come and the floods multiply and the unexpected fires burn homes down, people who no matter what is taking place today, there is a flood. Noah, yeah. go into the boat quickly. A big flood is coming. <laughs> oh, fool. Destroying his whole creation. Purging it. There was no other way to save it from total self destruction. again and gathered to build a tower that was supposed to reach heaven to be like God. Allow me to thank you for leaving those humans of yours alive. They are building my kingdom down there. They think it's their kingdom. <laughs> I don't mind, as long as it keeps them motivated. The master confused their languages, so they couldn't work together anymore. But this spirit of Babel stuck with the humans, building man's kingdom on earth, independent from God. The spirit of Babel. I was taught to think that independence is good desirable. So the master asked a man named Abraham to become the father of all those who trust and obey him, of those who understand their dependence on God. When do you want me to leave? Tomorrow. Stay with us. Sam, can you hear me? Hang on, stay with us.
Master, the humans are descending into chaos. Darkness is flourishing. Wickedness is taking control. are enslaved and murdered. <laughs> Nothing be done to stop this iniquity. <laughs> Where do you come from? From walking back and forth on the earth. By the way, the reports that you are getting are one-sided. My subjects, unlike yours, are free to do what they want. Freedom, independence, that's how you measure the love of a ruler. Of course, there is some minor collateral damage. Nothing to worry about. Your freedom is but a mere illusion. The despair and grief on Earth prove it to its fullest. Gabriel, no! Father, it's time. None of us knew about this plan. A divine being in the body of a mortal human? We still do not understand how it was possible. Even after he started his ministry, we didn't understand what the end of it should be. You call me Lord, and you say well, for so I am. Whoever exalts himself will be humbled, and he who humbles himself will be exalted. You call me Lord, yet I did not come to be served, but to serve and to give my life a ransom for many. What are you doing here on Earth? You are breaking the rules of the game. You are trespassing. This is my territory. A territory gained by deceit. And still I have here the descendants of Abraham. Really? Your disciples? <laughs> Those who fight over positions in your so-called kingdom? They will abandon you. Whenever you need them the most, you will see soon enough. <laughs>
Father, I thank you that you have heard me. Lazarus, come forth. This man claims to be divine. He says he brings a new kingdom. Brothers, we claim to be the descendants of Abraham, who left the earthly kingdom, searching for a better kingdom. What if this is indeed the kingdom we are looking for? And who's going to rule it? A carpenter from Galilee? This is nonsense. How about this kingdom? It took us thousands of years to build it, but here he comes and destroys it piece by piece with his lies and so-called miracles. He, he claims to destroy and rebuild the temple in three days. He pretends to be God. Now, why would God come here? We are his vicars on Earth. We run things down here. But this Jesus says we cannot rule ourselves. That we are dependent on God. That's a dangerous doctrine. Attacking our freedom. Our very independence. Father. Forgive them, for they do not know what they are doing. Eli, Eli, Lama Sabachthani. You do not look like the Son of God to me. Where are your disciples? Have they all forsaken you? Are you prepared to die for them? They are not interested in your kingdom. Remember the Flood and Babel as well. You thought you would change the course of history. But they always come back to me. They just want to live in the here and now. Be reasonable. It isn't worth it. It is finished. Into your hands, I commit my spirit. Eternal God dying? For us? For me?
too. <laughs> Naomi? Samuel! I am not leaving you. Everything is going to be fine. I'm getting better. I told him to visit you. Miss Goldman? Officer Smith and Officer Jackson. We would like to ask you some questions. We understand that you were there. My disciples, the descendants of Abraham, you and whoever believes in me, Jew or Gentile, you will receive a power by the Holy Spirit, and you will spread this message of salvation to the entire world. Then the end will come. could take the throne by force. was found in heaven no more couldn't everything just stop right there not until everyone makes their decisions Danny? What are you doing here? You almost killed him. I... If they find you, you'll go to jail. Not gonna happen. I'll crash at a friend's place up in the mountains. 
lay low for a while. You should come too. Danny! If you really love me. You know I do. <sighs> now go! Receive a power by the Holy Spirit, and you will spread this message of salvation to the entire world. Brothers, we have been told that God is distant to us, but God so loved the world that He gave His only Son that whoever believes in Him should not perish, but have eternal life. For God did not send His Son into the world to condemn it, but that the world The good news of salvation spread like fire in a dry land. The kingdom of men was under attack by the kingdom of heaven. But Lucifer was determined to fight back. the faster the kingdom of heaven was growing. For centuries, we have been trying to defeat them, and nothing works. Why don't we try your favorite weapon? Freedom. Who said that? We all know that power and humbleness don't go well together. In high-ranking positions, Christians should be favored. It should be desirable to be a Christian. If we destroy its purity, the religion is powerless. <laughs> Excellent. Go all of you and do your work. I shall take care of the Emperor myself. Make sure we get rid of him. He's too smart. This new plan was fatal indeed. Soon after, the kingdom of man was built right inside the church. Ages.
heretics were hiding dangerous books which are forbidden by the Holy Church. You need no books. They will just confuse you with lies. With lies. We are Christ vicars on earth. We are his messengers. My plan worked perfectly. Christians, especially, were extremely helpful. Their leaders oppress, torture, and kill their subjects as a service for their Jesus. Marvelous. <laughs> Master, they suffer tremendous injustice. Even if you comfort those martyrs, the crowds are led to think that you run this madness. You must do something before it's too late. The Master chose an anonymous monk to reveal his lost teachings and share them with the world. We have been told lies for too long. God is not distant, he is near, delivering you from your iniquities. Our Lord gave his life so that every one of us can be saved. Believe in him, change your life and you will inherit the kingdom of heaven. Since then, the kingdom of heaven has been proclaimed to peoples and nations. Some heard the proclamation and decided to follow. Enough oppression! We want freedom! But the evil done in more than a thousand years could not be erased from people's minds anymore. Having no moral standards, people slowly fell prey to all kinds of uncleanliness. religion for all evil and tried to expel it from their lives. supposed to visit me? Master, people expelled you from their life. Moral landmarks vanished, and morality is a matter of personal opinions now. Good is called bad, and bad is called good. And now, in a desperate attempt to save their societies from collapsing under moral decay, Religion is reinforced, changing your laws and ignoring your will. Now, more than ever, we need religion in our lives. 
All paths lead to God. We have to unite and build a new world order. The kingdom that all our great ancestors dreamt of. From now on, whoever's not with us is against us. Those who believe and trust in you are just a remnant, and they refuse to unite in this farce. So they have become persecuted again. There is no one else who wants to be saved. He who is unjust, let him be unjust still. And he who is righteous, let him be righteous still. of the justice of God on the earth. True and righteous are your judgments. faith. Samuel, that's my brother. What's he looking for? He is looking for you. 
Am I there? In the crowd? Resurrection is about to come, and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. There shall be no more death, nor sorrow, nor crying, nor pain, for the former things have passed away. to make a fundamental decision. They all have to 